Guys, uh, today I'm gonna show how to create a QR code scanner using Google Vision API. Uh, basically, Vision API is uh, some part of uh, Google Play Services repository. So we need to import the uh, import the Vision API through the dependency Gradle dependency. So let's start. QR code scanner is our application google.vision is our world pack com company domain and the package name is vision.google.com.gov so whatever you want you can edit also and, uh, next in is the minimum sdk um the activity i will take empty activity so next main activity so finish let the gradle compile uh, So I have done a previous video using uh, ZSync library. So it is a third party library. If someone asked me how to use uh, Google Vision API. So I want to make a video about uh, Vision API. So this is the video about that. So after the Gradle synchronization, just open Gradle scripts and you need to add the Gradle dependency here. So open, um, open build.gradle. So you just need uh, zoom right um, just wait a minute um, so this one module app so you need to open this file and add the dependencies as follows so here compile Com dot dot Android dot DNS play services column ten dot zero dot one. So you need to check the version control. So I checked uh, ten point zero point one is the latest one. So, and this is the Gradle compile dependency. So, after compilation, just ignore the Apple plugin. Um, the man test file. So, and permissions. So, and if you app needs internet permissions, you have to update internet also. So, for that, Android permission dot internet. You need to update metadata here. So, metadata, Android name. So, here, com dot Google dot Android dot DMS dot so here the dependencies values of so this is my data I need to provide to the this application update the camera permission of this so android true so by providing these two you can make a button uh, in the middle of the screen to main activity
I can integrate under the data the active is in package and go to go to empty active. And even if just I'm giving can active because it can start. I get the scan active. Intent, write an intent. Intent, intent is equal. Active dot this. Just declare a static code. Just code. And so we need to check uh, if there if there is a permission granted for this app to uh, access camera. So for this, if context compact, self permission context. So this is context. What is the permission? Inch manager. Not equal to if is not granted. We come back. Provides the permission. Just permissions. This provides uh, just a small uh, on menu. It shows uh, access, allow access, and delete. We'll work about later. And then this is, this is our camera layout. You need to, if you want to full screen, just move the. So in order to provide a uh, need surface view. To detect, to detect barcode. So barcode is uh, under form of QR code. So in order to get QR code, we must uh, declare a barcode detector and number source all or these under the API. So, so to hold the surface, surface holder is must. Surface holder, holder. This is all those. Order was ordered uh, this QR code. This helps the our uh, QR code in our. Does not bar code. So if it malfunction, so you need to get application. Uh, app exit uh, to build camp this it facing and two zero to go for HD. You are building canvas first. The surface created. It is what we call.
Ya, ini ingat, ingat konteks ini itu. Kita langsor. Dasar itu. Is review detection. So this is the main. Main activity. This use final as boolean array. Here came detection. We detected. So we have a uh, called bar. Hold. Intent. We just use the first index. You are sending barcodes for value. Oh, is equal to is equal to. Oh, is equal to. Here, if data. Here, intent data. Here comes the output. Here, barcode. Not date. Table extra. Mm. Yeah, we need to have uh, implement this. Dot. So this is our tab. So run. So So uh, we need to open here. How are you? So this is the process of our uh, code using Google Vision API. So I'm showing another example. This is an example of Google Vision API. 